This footage from Israeli security forces shows fireworks tossed from inside the Al-Aqsa Mosque. More fireworks were thrown at police from the old city's alleyways. The latest round of clashes between Palestinians and Israeli security forces was triggered when riot police entered the Al-Aqsa Mosque compound to secure it for Jewish visitors. The holy site is important to both religions, and this year, Ramadan, Easter and Passover are all occurring at the same time, adding to the tensions. We were forced out of the mosque after the dawn prayer. Then Jewish settlers started to enter. After we saw two groups of them, we started to chant and the Israeli forces tried to detain me. While non-Muslims are allowed to visit the site, praying there is off limits and any attempt to do so is considered a provocation. More than a dozen Palestinians were injured in the clashes and several arrests were made. The unrest follows several scenes of violence at the same holy site on Friday, in which more than 100 people were hurt and comes after weeks of mounting tensions. Since the end of March, there have been several deadly attacks in Israel carried out by Palestinians. In return, Israeli forces have mounted extensive raids in the West Bank, resulting in mass arrests and the deaths of several Palestinians. The recent surge in violence has left the country on edge as worries grow that this could escalate into a wider conflict.